Yo, quick update from Oviedo. Things are happening, and it's very exciting. Um, um, my, I'm staying with my buddy Harrison. Harrison got super hoop dreams, which is awesome. So we, we're about the same build. We're both about six foot. I'm 160. He's 170. Both have a similar amount of bounce, similar skill set. Uh, he's a lefty. I'm a righty. Anyways, Harrison is on a team in Oviedo. Um, it's the second best team in the city, and they are he's like underneath un, underneath the pro team or whatever. And if they win out in playoffs, they're going to get to move up and be part of the national team, and he's going to get to travel around Spain playing. So he's got hoop dreams. He's like, got a game tomorrow. I'm going to film some stuff, but got a game tomorrow and against the best team in their division or whatever. So he's on that grind. Um, I'm about to practice with them a little bit, but they, he has connections um, to the pro team or whatever, like when they're out of town. We'll see the pro team play. And when they're out of town, they get on the hardwood, so I'm going to get on actual hardwood here, staying for a month. Hopefully get to practice with the pro team. If not, there's some. I've got some uh, some options in Germany, but it's just very exciting. I feel that I'm at a premium um, guard skill set. Just, you know, I, I feel limited by inability to communicate, but things are definitely happening. And at the very least, I'm playing basketball, basketball overseas. I'm not a professional by by any means right now but I'm you know I'm over here I'm getting on courts we've got a little five on five run tonight working on my jump shot and it's my range feels very good that's you know a big thing that I need to work on have needed to work on is improve the consistency of my shot um, it's not my game doesn't depend on it but I like to have it so that's something that's going on something else caught the train to Oviedo yesterday and I was in the train station and one of the pro Spanish teams came through bunch of them, obvious, they're all super tall, swagged out in their Nike gear, black with like teal stripes, and it, I, I, I was in the train station with my basketball. It wasn't really an opportunity to do anything, they were going to another train, but I was just like, there's, there's opportunities here in Europe that I don't have in Seattle, so we'll see what happens. If any of you guys can help me when I'm over in Germany or have any advice or have access to any courts or anything, um, hit, hit me up, and if you guys are missing all the training mixes and stuff like that, um, wait till the summer. Like, Energy Efficient Basketball as a channel has only existed since the summer. Summer, I'll be back in Seattle and I'll be training a lot, and I'll have all kinds of videos up. But we're in season now. I'm not on a team, but uh, I'm still training and spending less time on that aspect. So, um. Just figured I'd give you guys a quick update, let you guys know what's coming and know what to expect and what not to expect. So thanks for everyone. Um, seeing, all, seeing all the new subs, I don't know where they're coming from or what videos they're coming from. Probably not the video logs, but um, shout out to everyone and thanks for all the love.